In this video, we're going to take a quick look at using the Find It at ONU option and requesting items through Interlibrary Loan. If you look at result number 11 here, you'll see there's two options. This will get you the full text at the Ohio Link EJC. This link will bring up all of the other options that we have to access the resource. Sometimes you will only see this option. So I'm going to click on Find It at ONU and you can see that there are multiple different options listed here. The first link is usually your best bet, but to show you something different, I'm going to click on the second one, view this article at Science Direct. So this opens it up in Science Direct, which is another database, and the option to actually access the article is here. Different publishers will place these links in different places, but always look for a PDF icon to get you the full text of the article. Um, if you only see this middle section, search journal, this means that you're actually going to have to find the article in the journal's table of contents. If that's the case, you take a look at the information up here, which tells you which volume and issue the article is located in. And the most important thing on this page, if you are having any problems accessing an article or the article doesn't appear to be available, fill out this form to let us know that something isn't working correctly. Okay, this email actually goes directly to me, Heather Crozier, the Electronic Resources Librarian, and I will look for the article, send you the article if I can find it, and try and fix whatever is going wrong. Okay, so I'm gonna close this tab and go back to the the um, database result page because I want to show you what it looks like if we don't have access to the article. If we don't have access, you'll see this request this item through interlibrary loan. This form should be mostly pre-filled for you and all you'll need to do is put in your name, your ID number, and your email and click submit. We will look for the article and get it for you at no additional cost to you. And as always, if you're having any trouble, please let a librarian know because we are here to help you.